We begin with breaking news. Gunfire outside a Walmart in the northwest suburbs. Good evening. I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. It happened in Palatine at the Walmart on Rand Road. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross is live on the scene with what happened. Jeremy. Good evening, Rob. Good evening, Erica. A developing investigation taking place right outside of Walmart. There is a lot we do not know this evening, but the business is confirming the shooting took place in the parking lot area right behind me. Now, shoppers we spoke with tell us this all started around 730 this evening. Police tape has lined the lot ever since. Evidence markers and clothing are seen on the ground near the entrance. Walmart telling us they're working with the Palatine Police Department in this ongoing investigation. No word on what caused the shooting, but it is unlike anything some have ever seen here. Yeah, man, so I just done got here. You know, I just hopped out the truck and I was walking inside because my lady sent me up here to get her a pack of cigarettes because, you know, ever since she got pregnant, she'd been real stressed out. So, you know, I was just walking in, had a can of Copenhagen in one hand, a fat pinch I was about to throw in the other, and then BANG! Out of nowhere, just ran into this little Mexican feller. And boy, you know I was so damn pissed off because I had done dropped my Copenhagen can, lost my pinch. But by that time, the little feller had already run off, screaming like he'd done heard a gunshot or something. And boy, I was livid. Then I felt a pinch in my back. Oh my God, I turned around like, what the hell? Some idiot done popping off birdshot in the parking lot. I was like, what you doing out here, boy? You just trying to piss people off? Why don't you get you some real ammo, pussy? After he realized he done fuck with the wrong motherfucker, I guess he just done hopped in his truck and took off. But anyway, I was like, fuck it. I got to go inside and get my old lady some cigarettes. So, you know, I walked up to the door. They had them locked. Why the hell they got the door locked? Like, the, the boy out here shooting off birdshot, he ain't fucking doing nothing. But anyway, they got doors locked because the idiot was fucking popping off birdshot. So I got to... I gotta go home to all lady without no damn cigarettes. That's a crime scene. That's where all the cops should be right now. Whenever I get home, that lady gonna put a damn bullet through my head because I ain't get her no damn cigarettes. Boy, it's not a shitty night, man. It fucking sucks, bud. It's scary, you know, because uh, to be honest with you, nowadays you're not safe anywhere no more. And whoever did this, you know, has to pay for what he did because he's putting everybody in danger, so. No word on the condition of the victim or if anyone is in custody in connection with this investigation. But what we can tell, there are a lot of surveillance cameras in the areas where police have been looking for this evening. We are live in Palatine. Jeremy Ross, CBS2 News. Robin Erica. Okay, Jeremy, thank you.